So in today's video, I'm gonna talk about a new holster I've been trying out, the Blackhawk Omnivore. Uh, it's a really unique holster, uh, something I have been looking for as someone who does uh, firearm instruction and runs a bunch of different uh, pistols and uses pistols that are, are given to me by students to test different things and uh, looking for a holster that's compatible with multiple things. So what is this holster? It's a Kydex holster, plastic holster, um, but what's unique about it is this holster is mated to the light and not the firearm. What do I mean by that? Obviously I'm using a, a plastic uh, uh, dummy for right now, but the TLR1 matches this holster. So you buy the holster to match your light. This matches Streamlight and Surefire lights, different models. So you buy it to match your model. And then as I put this in, it clicks down and locks in on the light itself. So what does that mean? It means that I can take this and I can put this uh, light on any of my pistols that has a rail and it fits in here and fits into this holster. It does cover the trigger, trigger guard. It has room for um, there's room for optics if you have them. It does, is somewhat adjustable, fits small, large pistols. They say it fits 1,500 different models. Obviously, I haven't tested that. So I've been running it for a little while, uh, and so far, I really like it. Um, so let's take a look at here. So you'll see that the mechanism for it, it's got a button release here. So it's a level two retention holster. So as I push that button, try to get an angle of it here, push that button, releases the pistol. Otherwise, it just stays in there nice and tight, nice and safe. Push that and release it. It's got adjustable sizes, so you can put larger and smaller buttons on it. I have the large button on it right now because it's, it fits my hand better, but you can do it for your own draw and your own uh, different style here. Um, yeah, it fits right on my belt. So I did have modified a little bit. This is the Safari Hand Q, uh, Safari Land QLS system, which my other holster ran on. Uh, I bought another quick clip and had to drill it out to mount to the Blackhawk. There are adapters, I just didn't buy one. So the Blackhawk doesn't mount to Safari Land if that's what most people you're using. Uh, it's all price too. So if you buy a custom Kydex holster that fits everything and fits your pistol and is light bearing, I mean, the Safari Lands will run you $140 up, I believe, from last I looked at them. Uh, you can get these for under 50 and they adapt to everything. So this is why I really like this. Um, it just allows me to put this weapon light on anything. Uh, I can still unclip it with the QLS system I have set up here and put a different holster on if I did feel like it. Like I have my other uh, regular Safari Land that's not uh, light mounted. So it works great. Uh, we'll throw the belt on real quick. All right, so, we'll, so I've got it mounted up here. It's my little mic down there too. All set. So it's got a nice easy draw, level two retention. Fits in there, it's a solid click. I have been training with this now uh, for a couple weeks. Um, specifically with just this one, I had been using a Safari Land which had the, the thumb pullback versus the push down. Took me a little while to get comfortable with it, but it's really simple, comes right up, comes right back down in it. Um, I really recommend this for anyone who, if you're a duty level, if you're an officer or you're out on, on patrol, I, this is not a duty level holster. It doesn't, it doesn't meet those standards, but for anyone who's just doing range stuff, who's training their own, who wants to put on their gun belt, who has multiple pistols or might be using different ones, it's a super great option. Um, it's got a little bit of wiggle, um, but that's because it's mounted to the light and it does have to adapt to everything else, but it's super secure. I've been running around in it, doing drills. I really like it. Uh, so if you're looking for a unique holster, Blackhawk, Omnivore uh, is the holster I'd recommend.